So now it is time to cheer for your boy or cheer for your character or cheer for whatever you like. But here we go. We have Tokido up against Mago. Grand Finals, that will be up next. Tokido has played Ryu throughout the entire tournament. Mago has played Cotton throughout the entire tournament as well. What is up, guys? This is Spooky, and thank you all very, very much for tuning in. I hope that you guys have had a great time at this tournament. Yesterday, we had some great Revelator play. We also had DOA 5, and we had uh, uh, the Street Fighter 5 3 on 3. Uh, now, we're going to have, of course, the end finally of the Street Fighter Singles Tournament. This is all a part of the Capcom Pro Tour. Event number 4 of 14 here for Capcom Pro Tour Asia. I'm here in Manila, Philippines, chilling in my condo. And the event is going to blow it up. No idea what's about to happen. Tokido must win two sets of three out of five if he wants to win the entire tournament. Uh, Mago only needs to win one set. Here we go. Oh yeah, we're going to Brazil. I like the stage. The stage is lots of fun. Full intro. This is the path of my destiny. Round one. Fight. Tokido starting off with tons of fireballs. He has to be aware that Mago loves to go for the shoulders. I wonder if he will adjust his gameplay for that. Early stun. What adjustment. Just go in and maul. Perfecto. Round number one. I want to win. That's what that perfect says. Round number two. Low MK. No more fireballs, huh? He chucked a lot of them in the first round, and this round he stopped. Punish opportunity. Orochi for the stun. That is almost 500 stun on that combo. Sure you in the super right back at you. You stun me, I kill you. Roundhouse. No crush counter. And the V-Skill misses, and Tokido closes it out. And you can see the big weakness of Cotton at 900 HP. Those Ryu combos will hurt every time. He's got to be just a bit more evasive. Karen tied with Kami for lowest health in the game. Big jump in at the start. Punish opportunity? No, he couldn't get it. Too far for the V skill there. That's been pretty fortunate. Nice neutral jump. Cole can get off. Wow, after the jump short, that was great reactions. Great reactions and great buffering. Fierce gets nothing. Mayoken. And that move, the Mayoken, is Karen's V skill. The regular version is actually minus five, a little bit unsafe, but the full charge version, only small minus. Uh, very useful for him attacking from long range. Does have lots of startup, and that's why you'll see that Tokido will often try to neutral jump when he predicts that it is coming. Ordinary got the knockdown. No counter hit on the low jab. He was hoping for that link that we've seen lots of from him earlier. Tokido not fighting on anything. He's defending himself well, and another nice neutral jump. He seems to understand Karen's ranges very well. Round two. Fight. Tatsu, nice sweet punish. There we go. Nice. Able to run up in time. Orochi for the stun. The stun is mounting quite quickly. Man, Tokido does not bite on that low MP setup. We seem to be so successful from on other players. Even the best of the best here in these top eights. But not Tokido. Uh, perhaps Mago should consider actually going for the tick throw rather than going for the double low MP just to scare him into trying to tech. That was nice. Orochi again. Crush counter. Oh, big miss input. Still worked out. Ouch. Sure you. And Mago has to be aware that although he has a huge lead, that it really only takes one or two combos for Tokido to bring it back. Great low jab. My man is on his phone during the grand finals. What is wrong with you, sir? You better put that phone down. Round number three. 
crush counter. Nice combo. Very optimal. He did so much damage. No meter required. And Tokido spends everything. Gets the life lead. Nice. There we go. That is that counter hit that we love. Walk up grab. Took lots of great help with that one. Two big whiff. Into the soup. That might whiff. That might whiff. Nope. It made it. It made it. Well done by Mago-san. The final attack. Cutting win. All right, 1-1. One, one. This is the fifth win for player one. Round one. Fight. Good uppercut. Huge damage again. And this is almost looking like another perfect. Poked his way out with the low jab. Missed the Orochi follow-up. That follow-up so difficult to do uh, consistently. The shoulder after the Tenko. I'm impressed that Mago goes for it almost every time like that. Tokido with round number one. Mayo Ken. Nice uppercut. Whoa. That was that was weird all around. Kind of worked out in Mako's favor. Another counter hit link. And now finally, finally his timing is starting to improve. Before he was not landing those counter hit jabs. Now he is. Seems to understand Tokido's timing just a little bit better. Mayokan misses. Great sweep. Ordinary. Your palms are close enough to my palms that I can get the knockdown with the V reversal. I want to see. There you go. More of that standing medium kick to check the sweeps. We know that Tokido's probably going to go for sweep into V trigger any moment now. Let's see if Mago can predict it and find a way around it. Nope. Bad news. Bad, bad news on that one. Shoulder. Nope. Tokido knows. Tokido knows. After the Garin Kim, the only option that is completely safe on the opponent is the kick extension. Even if you go for the plus frames elbow, if they know it's coming, they can just down jab like Tokido did there. Round one. Fight. Nice sweep. Medium kick into sweep again. Shoulders. Ouch. Shoulder again. Roundhouse. No crush counter. Again. Again. No, no. He was really hoping that the low MK would hit. Did not have time to hit confirm it. Nice one. And another nice one from Tokido as well. Sure you into super. Close it out. Eat my plasma. And this is looking very, very close to a reset. Round, two. Round number two. Links, shoulders, baits, punishes. We have everything. Nice again. Stun once again starting to mount. Some kind of ES got snuffed there. Another try and Coke and lands. Sweep attempt missed. Sure you. Great pressure with the standing medium punches. 
Mago-san forced to back off. Nice empty low into the super again. Double critical art finish for the bracket reset from Tokido. Oh, we got a run back of what just happened. Haha, -ha, that's even funnier. It looks like I need to refresh my feet soon. <laughs> so random that that happened. Reset. I like how it happened right at that moment. Pretty funny. Sorry about that. That was just our feed recovering a little bit there. Even more hilarious that it happened right at that moment. <laughs> that was not me, guys. By the way, that was an accident. Still cool that that happened. <laughs> <laughs> Not intentional. Pretty funny though. All right, next game coming up any moment. <laughs> Round one. <laughs> All right. Fight. All right. Match reset. Mago San versus Tokido San. Fierce into Tenko into shoulder to start it off again and again. We've seen this before. Amazing pressure. Sure you can. Great cross under. That was sick. Tokido able to block in time. Shoulder. Call Ken. Tokido, another critical art. Three critical art finishes in a row. Jump back MP, just trying to escape. Mago's timing during the pressure has been quite, quite solid, but Tokido's defense just as solid. Big whiff on the crouching HP. Ouch. Stun is imminent. And he Kaokens just to get away. Still stun imminent. Beyond. Be on your guard. Scoop. Lots of V trigger meters still available for Mago here. Kaoken. He just went for it. Quite risky, but it works out well. Lots of people watching in-house at the event. Taiwan Fighter Major 2016. Great high-level play of the newest by the Capcom Boy Street Fighter V. And I hope that you guys are loving this because this has been great. Sure you into super again. How many supers can I do? Tokido. Tatsu. Cross up. Throw. That is the game. One to zero. He is running away with this entire set. You win. Running away with the set. Round one. Fight. So far, it's been four match wins for Tokido in this set and one match win for Mago. We are in the second set of Grand Finals. Both players are in the loser's bracket. Whoever loses this set of best of five will be eliminated. The winner will win the entire thing. All the marbles, all the dollars, and those delicious, delicious Pro Tour points. Fierce, Tenko, Orochi. Dude, they are going so ham at each other. Almost a whip punish there. Cole Ken, don't jump at me. I can see you. Activation. Nice, got him. I imagine that perhaps Tokido was looking for the throw there. But Mago mixed it up really well. Roundhouse. Mago's very aggressive with the standing HP. Uh, it is a good normal and it's got great range and gives you great confirms. Uh, 
so I can understand its usage. It is a little slow. That's his biggest weakness. Many, many times that I pressed that standing HP hoping to counter hit the opponent and instead it was snuffed. And we've seen Tokido do the same thing here. There's a nice fierce. Shoryu gets crush counter. Why would he do that? I wonder. Tokido going a little too ham. Pays the price. Cameron's got super available. Trigger available. Big trigger activation in the super would definitely close it out here. Shoulders. Lots of great life building up. Be on your guard. So much great life. Mago, so much corner control. Nice one into super again. Good. Final round. Fight. Close, close sets. Mago really hoping to find a way to confirm into that super, I imagine. But Tokido's defense too strong so far. Another counter hit down jab. Too far for the double tenko. You're supposed to combo into Visco when that happens, but it can be difficult to tell the spacing in the heat of the moment. Weak. Great block. Activation, good neutral jump, but could not catch him on the way down, and Tokido gets the hit. Trades. Roundhouse. A big crush counter here from Mago again. Oh my god. He wants it so bad. Kaoken has to spend some bar just to keep him out. The super is no longer looming, but we have a nice crush. He should have done crush counter activate there. Oh, Mago-san. I wonder. Nice sweep punish to close it out. And the score is now 1-1. One to 4-2 one. to two in games. There is no player in the winner's bracket anymore. Tokido has already reset it. Both players are in losers. The winner of this best of five takes it all. Ordinary. Tokido fighting his way out of the corner. Crush counter. V skill. Nice. Great movement. No, oh no, Mago, please. I'm not sure if that was intentional, but he definitely paid for it. Big combo, Tokido with the jump in. Fierce got the anti air frame. But Tokido immediately escaping with the 171 tech. For those not familiar with that technique, there's a technique where you press uh, up back, down for uh, up back, down back, up back. And then you press tech. What will happen is if the opponent attempts to throw you, you'll tech their throw. If they go for something else, you often have a chance to jump out. Very popular among the Japanese players. Cole Ken. Fierce. That worked out really well for Mago. Into the Orochi, into the Super. This might be enough. The final attack. Oh, lived on a pixel. Sure you can. That was a very obvious jump in, and Tokido made him pay. Backed him off, but the down jab caught a poke. He takes the round. Final round. Fight. Shoulder. Yeah, Justin points out that a few times now uh, he's gotten crush counter roundhouse and gone to V skill or something else when he could have gone straight to trigger. Uh, a slight, slight weakness in his game there. Everyone has their weaknesses even at the top level of the game. Despite that, he's been playing these sets very well. Tokido's defense has been superior for the most part. And that's what's allowed him to win games. He's also hit lots of these critical arts just like this one. Go, go, go. 
Can he find a way to come back in this round? No, he cannot. The low medium kick will keep him out, and Tokido is up 2-1 to one in the final set. And the winner's bracket advantage for Mago-san has completely evaporated. Completely. And if he was not feeling the heat before, he definitely is now. Round one. Fight. Sure you can. Tatsu after the low short. Another Tatsu. This might be another quick stun. Nice interruption with the low medium punch. Still cornered, still finding his way out. Very nice with the double Tenko. Into throw. Love the beat of the Brazil, st the Brazil stage. Really matches well with this matchup. Good scoop. Another. This time from Mago's side, another. How many scoops can I get? He's looking for super. Watch out, Mago-san. Do not get caught. He will definitely critical arch you and kill you right now, just like he's done many rounds in this set. Max range sweep. Kept him safe. Got him. Fierce. Tenko. Tenko. Good stuff. Good break. Oh, that was bad. Bad, bad news. Eat my critical card again. I don't even know how many that is anymore. He's done so many of them. Very consistent with the critical card. Sure you can. Gets nothing. Tenko. EX Tenko. Looking for the mix-up. The EX Tenko does a bit more damage and stun than the regular as well. Looking for any type of forward movement or button press from Tokido with those standing roundhouses from max range. Sweep activate. Uh-oh, uh-oh, the corner. You don't want to be here. He's trying to fight his way out. Lots of free chip with the Raijin fireballs. Got him. The Fei Long specials. Cutting win. Alright. So here we are, the final game of Grand Finals. I cannot believe that we've made it all the way here. TW Fighter Major 2016. Nice fierce. Nice lows. Sure you can no go eat my crush counter. And now Mago is the one in control. Big jumping combo potential. Can he get it? He went for the jab. Reset did not land it, but still has a scoop. Nice break. Tokido staying alive with the solar plexus blow in the combo. No parry that time. That would have been ridiculous. Sweep into activate. Mago's got, excuse me, Tokido's got a critical art again. Mago has one too, but he does not really need it. If Tokido hits, oh my god, please don't get hit by critical art. Mago son. Alpha counter. No, he could not. Did he have tri did he have trigger bar, I wonder? Do not remember if he had any V-bar left to get away from that. Anyway, clutch, clutch, chip out. You see the C at the top. Very rare that you'll see that one. Only supers can chip in Street Fighter V. Fierce, Tenko, shoulder. Nice jump in. Could not even tell which side he was on. Don't think Mago could either. Nice. Oh, man. He should have gone for Tenko there. Went for Fierce instead. Nice. Counter hit. Combo follow-up. He's going for the shimmies. Tokido's the one actually in trouble. Can Mago clutch it out? Will the winner's bracket advantage work out in his favor? Big interruption. Tokido. Activate. Nice low. He's in control. He's got him in the corner. The only thing he does not have is the life lead. It's very dangerous. Very dangerous for both sides. Ryu's building meter bit by bit. Nice break. So dangerous. Shoulder whiffs. Big, big whiff. And Tokido very close to actually making it into the life lead now. 
Fireball will take the lead. Slowly he's getting walked down to the corner. Nice sweep. Grab for the closeout. And Mago-san took it with the throw. Very, very impressive finish. The choke was so real on Tokido's part. He was so, so close to taking it. But in the end, Mago finally finally aware of those very, very dangerous low short, low jab into super setups. Good, good stuff to him. You can see that the crowd loves it. I love it. I'm definitely a fan of Mago-san. So awesome that two of my favorite players, Justin Wong and Mago-san, both playing my favorite character, Karin, and they're both very, very successful with her. That is awesome and amazing. Good stuff. Good, good stuff. Tokido always second place. Sorry, Tokido-san. We all know at home that you are so, so very strong. But unfortunately, again, you ran into a very, very tough opponent in the final. And it just happened to be your good friend, Mago. Yeah, the curse is very, very strong. The curse is very, very strong. Thank you to everyone that watched, by the way. That was really awesome. A great tournament. Once again, my name is Spooky. Thanks to everybody that watched at home. Hope that you guys really enjoyed it because that was a great uh, tournament. Lots of nice high-level play. Looks like they're going to have a little bit of a, a outro for you guys. So let's peep that and see what is going on. Thanks again, everyone.